I got to work and there was a message on my voicemail and it was the woman who had come to visit me and she said, uh, we've selected you for a home. Um, it's a three bedroom townhome in Woodbury. I hope that that's all right. And I'm thinking, are you kidding me? <laughs> you hope that's all right? I live in a one bedroom, 25 by 12 foot room. Uh, yeah, I think I can handle a three bedroom in Woodbury. <laughs> Come on. I had been on the job for, oh, probably a week uh, or two weeks, and one of the first calls I got was from Mayor Hargis saying, I'd like to talk with you about what we're doing in Woodbury and I'd like you to meet our new city administrator and could you come out and talk with us so you could build more habitat homes in Woodbury. We were very comfortable with the habitat model and their reputation so we thought this would be a good way to get started uh, to invite habitat to do some projects out in our community. Well our partnership with habitat and and really with the city of Woodbury started from the very beginning of this process and planning and working together to make sure we we could uh, figure out a way to get 30 units um, within the Bailey's Arbor neighborhood and the city has been great from the very beginning. Our Habitat homeowners are so delighted to be able to move into this beautiful new townhome in the city of Woodbury. What's most exciting for me working at Habitat is getting to see the kids the first time they walk in the door. Um, they jump around and move from one room to the next and take you by the hand and say, come look at my bedroom, look at what my house is going to look like. The families are really excited to be there. It's a, it's a fantastic opportunity for them and for their kids and for the future of their family. When we first found out about the house, I brought them here. My daughters were elated and my oldest daughter, Faith, she's just like, is this ours, Mom? And I said, yeah, she was all ours. And I'm like, yes, it's all ours. And she said, no grandma, no grandpa. And I'm like, no, no grandma, no grandpa, just us. And I'm like, yes, it's just us. And she was just excited. I mean, very excited. The model is great. It's the American model. If you put some sweat equity in, you uh, become part of the community. You know, I never thought I would enjoy doing it. And I got here and I'm like, you know, this is really neat. You know, you're learning how to do something. It's out of the ordinary things that, well, for me, that I do day in and day out. So, it, you know, the days off of work are so worth it. And, you know, you get to learn a, a new trade. And, you know, I'm kind of thinking that I might want to do this for a living. Well, we have built in 30 cities around the seven metro county area. And we love to have the opportunity to build in the suburban communities. Our families really want what all of us want for our children. They want to have safe schools, access to jobs, and they want to live in a safe neighborhood. And certainly they can find that in the suburban communities where we're building, like the city of Woodbury. I would encourage all of our uh, communities to be involved in uh, affordable housing because it's a regional issue. It, it, strengthens our region, it strengthens our economy. I mean, who, who doesn't have that American dream of having their own place? I mean, really, absolutely. And I, wouldn't, I would not be able to do it without Habitat.